Genie World is a world-class manufacturer of interactive and display technology. The product you see here is a G-Touch. It is 10-point touch. It is a commercial LED panel. It is shatterproof. It has forward-facing speakers, so no need for a soundbar. And it has soft keys for easy functionality. Uh, the G-Touch comes in two models. The first model is a classic with standard six-point touch. The deluxe model comes with an inbuilt Android operating system and the facility to have a, an inbuilt PC. The screens come in various sizes from 32 all the way up to 84 inch. They are eco-friendly and power saving. I'd like to just introduce Spark, which is our presentation software. The first thing I'd like to do is if I just select the pen tool there, so I could kind of just write with a pen there. Obviously, uh, that green colour's not showing up very well, so if I just toggle back and do that, I'm going to change the colour to maybe uh, a black. So if I kind of write hello on there, you could use a pen there, or if you wanted to, you could actually use your fingers. A default setting within Spark, everything you do is recorded. So if I hit that button there, you can actually see the green writing and it's played back in real time. If I wanted to focus just on the HE, uh, you'll notice there's four icons. Uh, the top right icon means you can rotate things around, okay? The bottom right, you could actually resize things. The top left, you can move it. And then if I click on the bottom left, you'll see there's a whole list of things you can do here. You can cut it, copy it, paste it, you could grip it, you could clone it, uh, you could hide it. But what I'd like to quickly show you is the loop playback. So now you're actually getting a playback function just with what you're focusing on. If we click on the clipboard and say we wanted to bring in a movie about some bees, we just tap on the bees, click on the open, then you can just drag it in. The software is very intuitive. If I click on the camera, we can actually take snapshots as the movie's playing. So if you're creating some kind of storyboard or if there's a process that you need to explain, uh, you can actually do that very easily and you can take as many snapshots as you want. Just below the camera, there is a little blue pen. So if we click on the blue pen, it will pause the video. We could actually annotate directly over the top. While our video is playing, uh, we have our snapshots here with some annotation over the top. What I would like to do is to bring in a visualizer as well. In the insert toolbar, just tap on that. Insert visualizer like so. Same process for how big you would like it to come in. I have a movie with some snapshots of the annotation there. Here I have a visualizer with something that's live in either the room that you're doing your presentation or your lesson with some snapshots. What I'd like to do is bring in some images from uh, the Genie World website. We can do region, irregular or screen. So if I click on region, and then maybe if we wanted to bring that in, it's as simple as that, bring that in. If I click on irregular, I just trace the outline of what I would like to bring in, very roughly, and then we can bring that in. If I wanted to, I could bring images in from PowerPoint. So this is my PowerPoint presentation. I can annotate, highlight, make notes, go on to the next page. What fruit did he eat, say? Maybe he ate an apple, making notes. So you would work through the presentation. Stop. Do you want to embed the handwriting into the PowerPoint file? Definitely not. Open Spark. All of the slides from our PowerPoint presentation have been brought into Spark. Once the uh, PowerPoint slide is inside Spark, we can put it up to the one side and then we can make some more notes along here if we wanted to about the PowerPoint. If I wanted to draw a triangle, like so, it will straighten the lines up. I could highlight it by drawing an arrow. View, bring in maybe a maths toolbar. The toolbar appears at the bottom. So if I wanted to measure an angle, I could do so like so there. If I wanted to draw a circle, I can use a compass to maybe draw a pie chart. Okay. If I wanted to highlight the angle, then I could draw a black line around like so. Bring in some different tools, a uh, curtain, so we could actually just show the audience just a little bit of our slide at a time. Spotlight, so now maybe make that a little bit smaller, 
we can actually have our James Bond theme. Maths toolbar is still open, so click on the view, maybe a different toolbar, maybe chemistry. So let's bring in a container. We just click on so, just like that. We can adjust the water liquid. We can even rotate it out. Uh, click on the apparatus. We could introduce some wire gauze, like so. Bring in a thermometer. We could add a tripod, like so, underneath there. And maybe some heat with the flame. So that's just uh, a little bit from the chemistry toolbar. Um, all of the slides that we're currently working on, there's a catalogue here that we wanted to. So if we needed to refer back or there were some questions raised from a point covered earlier, then it's quite easy to select the slide that we actually work from. If we click on the file tab, um, we could actually save it as a Spark file or we could actually save it and export it as all of those formats there. We have an image file, PowerPoint file, PDF, HTML, directly to the website, and also just as a, a Word document. If we wanted to send it an email, we could actually send it as those formats there. Genie Will provides a range of stands and mounts suitable for any training and educational environment. They can also be used at promotional events such as exhibitions and conferences. The range includes wall mounts, freestanding trolleys and electric powered variable stands. Our high-low stands feature motorised height adjustment while our high-low flip stand turns through up to 90 degrees, enabling it to be used as a vertical or tilted display stand or a table base, supporting interactive screen tabletops. The Genie Vision range of visualizers features models with stunning quality high definition cameras designed to work perfectly with our G-Touch range of interactive touchscreens. Our Vision visualizers enable presenters to display objects on an interactive screen, whiteboard or computer to large audiences during live presentations. Visualizers can capture still images and video and when combined with software such as Genie Toolbar or Genie Spark, enable you to annotate, highlight and draw over the objects and save your annotation as an image or video file. What we have here, this little black box, is called a Genie Sync. It allows you to connect up to 64 devices on any platform. Here we have Windows playing a video. Here we have an iPad taking a live video. Here, I'm using my phone. What the Genie Sync allows you to do, it allows you to connect up to 64 devices to the screen at one time. When you're showing the devices, you can do it like so here. So you have four devices at any one time, or you could just have one device for the full screen. If I would like to write something here, hopefully you can see that it's actually coming through. So you can actually use any device to present on this screen. Genie World Audience Response Systems enable audiences or students to give instant feedback or answer questions posed by the presenter. The audience can give immediate responses using either dedicated wireless handsets or devices such as laptops, tablets and smartphones. These responses are analysed and presented in real time on the G-Touch screen or interactive whiteboard. Questions can be created in advance or during the presentation in as few as three clicks. They can range from simple yes, no responses through to multiple choice or text answers. Audience response systems have been shown to increase engagement and participation in classrooms. The respondents' contributions can be analysed while the discussion is current, enabling the presenter and other participants to provide instant feedback. Genie develops specialist presentation and educational software that integrates seamlessly with interactive LED screens and whiteboards. Genie World's ClassCom 5 audience response software offers audiences and students the ability to respond instantly to questions posed by the presenter. ClassCom Cloud is Genie World's simple to use cloud-based assessment software. Questions and information slides can be created using its powerful content editor 
and built-in templates, then stored in a customizable online databank and shared with multiple recipients. Genie World's audience response software, Census, is a floating toolbar that sits over other applications. Genie Spark provides an infinite canvas and a host of features to make your presentation slicker and more professional. Genie Cube is used to import resources from your network, visualizer, or the internet to help you create engaging and exciting presentations, templates, and lesson plans. CubeShare is a browser-based application enabling you to share your canvas and live presentations with others in the same location or remotely via an internet connection. Genie Toolbar is designed to work with interactive LED screens and whiteboards, visualizers and Genie Slate. It sits over the top of other applications and offers an array of easy to use professional presentation tools. Early Years On Board is a collection of educational games and resources for children aged 3 to 5. Children learn better through interactive games and activities, and Early Years On Board focuses on core competences in maths and English. Genie Explorer educational software includes thousands of high quality educational animations and images. Students can explore by subject or curriculum using the software's navigation directory or built-in search engine. Genie Primary Gold is a collection of educational resources developed by teachers, curriculum writers, photographers and animators specifically for key stages one and two. Genie Secondary Gold is a collection of educational resources developed by teachers, curriculum writers, photographers and animators but for key stages three and four.